Uh, first of all, we talked with residents who live in an apartment building right across from where this all happened. They said that about five past nine, they heard what they thought was fireworks, but no, a single bang that turned out to be a gunshot. By the time they looked out the windows, there were a swarm of state troopers at the on-ramp at the exit 43 on Route 8 northbound. And uh, so uh, we've just learned that it wasn't a traffic stop that had happened, but reports from drivers of a man walking along Route 8 northbound carrying a knife. And uh, a northbound trooper reached the scene a very short time later. Uh, we're hearing that he tried to talk to the man. The man charged at him with the knife, at which point the trooper fired what we believe is a single shot at the man. He was, uh, he was, uh, he was hit. And uh, the trooper then tried to give him emergency uh, treatment, uh, followed up by uh, ambulance treatment and transport to Charlotte Hungerford, Hungerford Hospital in Torrington, where he was pronounced dead uh, virtually on arrival or a very short time later. The only information we're getting confirmed from state police right now about the man who died is that he lived in Torrington. We don't have his age. We don't have his name. But that is all they have right now. We are anticipating that further information could come out very shortly with notification of next of kin of uh, the deceased, but also the trooper's name is being withheld to give him time uh, to talk with his family and let him know that he was involved in a shooting incident. We do know that the trooper was working alone at the time. There was no partner with him in his cruiser. And that's essentially what we know right now, but also want to let you know, if you're heading northbound on Route 8, uh, between exits 42 and 44, you will be diverted and detoured. That's the northbound side. Southbound is not affected, but that detour is expected to last for several more hours from this point at least. We are live in Torrington, or very near Torrington. Jeff Ballin, News 8.